Welcome to another episode on our channel. If you've watched The Walking Dead, you'll immediately recognize this figure as Rick Grimes. He's the lead character, or was the lead character in The Walking Dead. We haven't watched all the seasons yet, but um, uh, my friend from the SNS channel had a few figures from The Walking Dead, and I started looking at them, and I got curious about the show, and I started watching it, and then I got hooked. And then by the time we reached, we we're getting ready for the sixth season, we'd seen so many people that we loved die on that show that it was just hard to, you know, have the courage to go on. But we need to keep watching it out. Um, it, it's only fair. So, uh, so this is Rick Grimes. Now, Present Toys, I have on pre-order Rick Grimes uh, from Present Toys, and he looks fantastic from Present Toys. If he looks, if he turns out to be what he looks like in the promo photos, it's going to be a great figure. Uh, so, but it's been on pre-order for some time now. Present Toys has come up out with a lot of really great figures like uh, Val Kilmer from Tombstone. Al Pacino and Robert De Niro from Heat, Jake Gyllenhaal from uh, Nightcrawler. So they made some good stuff. So I'm hoping that this uh, Rick Grimes is going to be a great one. But in the meantime, I do have Rick here. And uh, when I do get from Black Op Toys, uh, the second figure that goes with pet number one of Michonne, um, I'll customize that and hopefully it will have a lot of people to relook at all over again with all those additions. So in the meantime, here is Rick Grimes. Apparently this person had customized the figure, changed out the body for an emulated body, and that's that's absolutely fine. Uh the only thing I don't like about uh, this figure. I don't know if it would have been true with the three zero body or not, but the the jeans are a little high. Um, they're over his boots. They're a little high up. I like the jeans to fit a little lower on on a body. But uh, other than that, oh, the other thing I didn't like was uh, the forty four Magnum and the holster kind of jutted out a little bit. I couldn't get it to stay close to his leg, so. Instead of using hot glue or anything, I decided to put two-sided tape there to hold it in place, and that worked fine. So so here he is. We'll pause now and get him on a turn tray so you can see him from different angles. I forgot to mention he came with this weapon as well, which we think is an Uzi. It kind of juts out like this. And then it can fold back like that. I don't know if that came with the three zero um, Rick Grimes or if she just threw it in to throw it in. But um, he's well armed. He has this. He has the AK assault weapon. He has the forty four Magnum. He's got um, uh, reloaders pouches for the reloaders on the back and hand cuts on the back. So uh, we'll go around so you can see them from different angles. There's the AK assault weapon, and then we're gonna see the handcuffs or the pouch for the handcuffs. I didn't even look to see if there were handcuffs in there. And the uh, speed reloaders pouches. I don't know if anything's on the inside, but there's his 44 Magnum. And there he is again. All right. So I wonder what two-sided tape will do. Holds everything in place very nicely. So uh, we'll pause so we can get some close-ups from here on. You can see uh, many more details now. He has this wonderful flannel shirt of dark blues and greens and so forth. You can see his jeans, his belt, his uh, holster, and his uh, 44 
magnum in, in pieces of his AK assault weapon. You'll be able to see his handcuff pouch much more clearly and the uh, speed reloader pouches. And he is definitely ready for action. Yeah. So we'll pause now and get a tight close-up of his face. Here's a good look at his face. We'll just turn ever so slightly here. And going back again. This is when he has a thicker beard. I'm not sure I like this look as much. But... There you go. Here's one last look at our figure. I hope you've liked what you've seen. If you have, consider giving us a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel. In the meantime, everyone, please have a great day.